Hey, Cypher here. When grading, I come across a lot of mistakes. Obviously, we all make them. Heck, I publicly make them on the channel all the time. But sometimes, these mistakes just have funny implications. At least if they were taken as truth. They're anachronisms. As in something that doesn't belong in its time. So I wanted to animate a few of these as though they were true. Not to publicly shame students, because that's unproductive, but to revel in the reason why they're funny. It's the silliness of the fantasy. When learning history, there's a lot of things to get mixed up, so I don't want to see comments about the students, especially since I've anonymized everything, and many of these are just common errors that are actually pretty insignificant. It's all about the implications, that's all. Each of these are small episodes, just to fill in the space in between larger releases. I also want to sincerely thank both Easy8 and Tageek for making these pictures. Tageek has helped the channel before, and he has a Facebook comic well worth checking out. Alright, so they were supposed to identify the Spanish Armada. You know that invasion attempt back in 1588, where Spain sent a fleet of ships to invade England, but they were pretty decisively defeated? But they kind of mixed it up with the Mexican army saying that they fought American Indians to drive them out of their territory, and that the Armada was eventually defeated by US troops during the Mexican-American War. So basically, the Spanish Armada was a fleet of ships that fought American Indians and Americans during the Mexican-American War. Like, imagine if the Spanish Armada just zapped through a portal into the American Southwest to fight Apaches. I'd certainly be afraid of a bunch of boats on tank treads. Those things would come out of nowhere. Cause after all, Nobody expects the time-traveling land navy 